Yo, 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 how you doing? I hope you're having a great day and holy shit, we got a lot to talk about. Now, I never thought I'd make a video about Paul from an uprising. I mean, I used to love watching his videos. I enjoy watching his videos. I do believe he's on point. I do believe he is telling the truth because, you know, obviously the elites are, you know, ruling this world, corrupting this world. I mean, there's a lot of things going on right now and we do need truth seekers. I myself am a truth seeker. But moving on to the topic. Now, I, to be honest with you, I have some mixed feedback about Call for an Uprising. Apparently, he got demonetized and already made a new channel called Placeholder Mystery. And he, of course, he would point fingers at YouTube because YouTube is corrupt and all. And don't get me wrong, guys, YouTube is actually corrupt. But this is pretty much different because Call for an Uprising is banned. And we have our fake independence on the 4th of July. Well, YouTube decided to hit every single one of my channels with what they're calling a severe violation of their YouTube policy. So finally, they've figured some way to connect all my channels together, which I already kind of figured that they could have done in advance, which is by checking on AdSense, which they also terminated. Now, don't get me wrong, guys. I don't justify what happened to Call because we both know that YouTube is corrupt. But I have to question his thinking. The only reason YouTube terminated his AdSense is because he's ban evading and he's breaking the terms of service. I mean, he's, chances are he could be uploading videos that actually do violate terms of service. YouTube is not a free speech platform. And if you really do want to get people to know the truth, like if you want to re-upload your videos, why can't you why can't you upload them on Odyssey or Gab or any other platform? Because YouTube is gonna keep on attacking you, attacking you over and over again. And it's just in my opinion, it's just really pathetic. Regardless, I think you're just baiting people to go to your website because since you're not making enough money on this platform, you just have to move on to the next and beg people to go to your website. But that's all I gotta say for today's topic. If you like this video, give it a like. If you dislike this video, give it a dislike. I appreciate all feedback to be given. Thank you and peace. Also, why isn't he preaching the good news?